Hello there. Today we are doing another uh, let's play. We're doing Creekside Creep Invasion. Um, now this one is on Indie Gala right now. It's part of a, a bundle, or you can just get it on Steam. Uh, you'll probably get some snoring during this. Mutant Dog is asleep on my lap, so I figured it was appropriate to do this game. What sold me on this is I tend to like roguelikes. I think I said before, I grew up with the original Rogue. Like, THE Rogue. We played it on an Atari ST computer, uh, which had a tape, cassette tape version of Rogue. So ever since then, I've been playing them. I played NetHack for a long time, which was an older rogue. Most of you will know that one. It's quite legendary. Falcon's Eye was the first, one of the first decent graphical versions. It was still a tile set, but they looked nicer than some. A little more polished. I just kept going from there. Anyways, this one is a good 80s feel. I don't know what the hell I'm doing in it, but we're going to just dive right in. And let's get to it. Normal, normal, marathon. Let's do normal, because I don't know what I'm doing. Where were... Huh? What is that? Halloween 1989. Guys, I cannot tell you how badly. If I had a time machine, and it sounds so petty, but I would love to... Uh, maybe go back to being, like, in my 20s, and then go back to the 80s, and just live that time again. Like, from the 80s to the 90s, just 10 years, and then jump back to nowadays. Just to get to have that experience I'd love. Um, Halloween 1989, in the small town of Creekside, Squirt slept soundly. Oh yeah, your main guy's name is Squirt. His belly full of well-earned candy. Just before midnight, Squirt was awakened by an ominous whirring outside his window. Um, I like all the little action figures that they got to the right. They got, it looks like, uh, Patrolman, 3D glasses, of course. Gotta love anything with a pumpkin in it. He peered out the window only to see a horde of ghastly creeps with glowing red eyes. They marched hypnotically toward the downtown creekside. Squirt had to muster the courage to find out why. Muster that courage, son. Telling the creeps down counts. Uh, Squirt discovered that the source of the mysterious whirring, a large growing antenna in the distance. We don't see the antenna yet. Um, the creeps seem to be drawn to it. He decided to get a closer look. I kind of like the variety of creeps here. We got some... My favorite so far are the mummy, and I really dig this, uh, the little skeleton dude there to the bottom right. And I'm kind of partial to the two little wizard looking guys there. Oh, big. Okay, there it is. From the rooftop of the comic book shop. Why not? Squirt saw some freak in a lab coat next to the antenna. He seemed to be using the antenna to control the creeps. And if you don't know, uh, Creeps is a takeoff of Night of the Creeps, which is a fantastic horror movie. Pretty, pretty gory, uh, but a lot of fun. I don't know what's going on here, but it ain't good, and I'm gonna stop it. And you better believe. In the 80s, if a kid had a headband and those fingerless gloves, he was kicking some ass. So we're going to be some ass kickers. Uh, so it says to hit escape. This is your local mini mart. You can upgrade it by finding upgrade tokens. Press escape. So we're going to press escape. Store upgrade status. Okay, that's the top one. Next ammo unlock. Next top two unlock. Check the status of your up unlocks here. To the left, check your player status here. Uh, so control is peak, space is dash. Uh, so I got three eggs, and I can backpedal. Uh, do I got any unlocks? Can I do unlocks? Store stock, I got some costumes here that I can pick. Uh, and some ammo. I don't know what all these do. I got eggs. I feel like a bowling ball would be pretty good, but heavy. Um, let's do the pirate, or do I just... No, okay. So it looks to me like right now I'm just seeing what I can do here. Okay. So return. So that is me, as I am. I got no dollars. No dollars. I can re even repair my armor. I can't repair my armor. So this is my store. 
Well, that's pretty damn cool. And I can buy little costumes. This place is a mess. Uh, well, shush. Out of order. It'd be cool. I don't know if this works, but if those little games work, that would be a nice touch. And if they don't, developer, that would be a cool 80s thing here. Even if this worked, like if the claw machine worked, even if that just gave you, like, if it gave you nothing but cosmetic shit, people would still play that, I think. Uh, okay, so we're gonna hit enter. We're gonna head downtown. Now, this is a roguelike, so this is pretty much random, what I understand. A lot of random shit. And I know if I run out of ammo, it's all random oh shit. Okay, so my ammo is three eggs at a time. Not that I only have three eggs, it's just three eggs at a time. That is a big... I feel like that's some bullshit right there. A randomized gun is equipped on ammo which is zero. Did I? It's zero I did. Oh my god, I need to be quicker. I'm, what am I doing? I'm just... My problem is I explore. Am I the only person who just looks at every friggin' thing in a game? Am I weird for that? I feel like when I get a new game, I check everything out, man. I look at everything. Um, I, di I didn't get any money. I want money. Is that a human? Did I just fuck up a human? Oops. I don't know. Anybody that cheats at me is going. That's all I know. That is clearly a vampire. Dracula, you are a creep. So you must go. I need the dollars. I need the dollars for the sweet, sweet upgrades, baby. I don't know who you are here, Scarface, but I can't fuck with you yet. Mystery box. I can't pick you up. Station wagons? Definitely dudes. Oh shit. Hotel no vacancy? No the rates. Also the 80s. CDS hotels. Oh look at that. Well those don't do shit. Come on! I hit you with my balls. It sounded bad. It's not really bad. Join. Oh, do not join club. You hear that, kids? Don't join club. Be safe out there. Don't join club. Oh, that is a big dude. Alright. Uh, I don't know what's going on. He's doing like the truffle shuffle. It's an 80s reference, guys. Hope you like that one. So we're gonna mess his day up. Um, I, I've been dying to play this one, actually, and show you all my dedication. This has been in my hard drive, uh, for days now, along with the last review that I did, but I don't touch them until I do reviews for you guys, because when I install them, I try to do these authentic, so if I can, I honestly, I honestly will not play them until I do them for you. Um, and if you don't believe me, you can tell I'm authentic with these. Look at my face and the dumbfounded look. You can't fake stupidity like this. I don't know if I should tell you that. I think I just insulted the shit out of myself, but... Dave's dogs. Now, you're gonna laugh at me, but, uh... I've always had this sort of pipe dream that I thought it would be fun to... as a side job or just for some extra money. Uh, run my own little hot dog cart, and I know everybody laughs at me, but think about how much of a killing they make with hot dog carts. You, you, I'll think I'm fucking with you, but think about it. If you go to, like, a place like Costco or any of them, how much are hot dogs really in bulk? Now think about how much you get buns for in bulk, and then you charge $3 per hot dog. How much profit are you making? Do the math there. It's a shitload of profit. You are making a lot. Oh no. Okay. So I got a few things here. So we're gonna start again. Do I hit continue? I think I hit continue, don't I? Yeah, I hit start again. Normal. I read somewhere though I get to keep all my shit. Alright, so... Back to the power fist. Yes! Okay, so I keep my money. And change my ammo, or I can do this now. What uh, difference do the costumes make? I want to know. What do you do? 
You are repair armor, but I don't quite understand what you do. I don't want to, like, buy something and commit to it if I don't know what it does. Alright, I like that idea. Can I at least look at this? Can it tell me what it does? No. Of course it can. Lock up. Okay, so that's a lock up, so that's something I want. Okay, so. That whole round took us... Not too, not, uh, not too shabby there, actually. Um. Not too shabby at all. Uh, I hope we can get to the downtown. I'm actually really curious out of all of these. I'm a sucker for cemetery things and games. Also, shame on you little shits that watch me for not interacting more with costume quests. That is a great Halloween game, guys. If you do not own it, start getting uh, that game. It is cheap all the damn time, man. One and two are both cheap, and I don't care how old you are, you are never too old to enjoy a little extra Halloween in your day, and then both those games are really fun. Um, so yeah, trust me, you will want those. Um, god, they're on sale constantly. Constantly, so... My advice to you all, pick that shit up. I don't know if those meteors are hurting me or if I'm doing that. I think I'm doing that. Oh shit, baby! Money and speed. Now I don't know what that is there. I got a little crowbar thing. Is that good? I don't know. Check armor items in the pause screen. Critical care. So I got that. Okay, so I need to get these arrows. Now the I know the upgrades also stay. Is there like a map? Can I hit M for map? No, there's not a map. What is does do? Oh, whoa. Whoa, whoa. That's dash. So Peek just lets me look around and hold that down without. That's cool. So see, I need to actually start paying attention to this shit more, guys. Now, I don't know what I'm telling you. I'm the dumbass one paying attention to all uh, button match. This actually reminds me of that review I did not too long ago. Shameless plug a little bit. Shameless plug there. Um, I wish you could go inside some of these places. That'd be pretty cool. Even if they just did just like generic versions of those. Um, that arcade. Um, the Retro Neon Arcade. It was pretty dang cool too. So that was a fun little one. Oh, what did I find here? Is this a secret? Oh, an underground shop run by Turtle. Shit, I don't got enough of that. I do like that they had a little nod to the new Turtles in this, so... Devs, kudos to you all. That was pretty damn badass right there. I was a massive new Turtles fan when they came out. First, I read the comics because a kid at my school was reading one, and I had no idea what the fuck he was talking about. He's telling me how awesome these mutant turtles are, and I'm like, yeah, what the fuck are you on about? Some turtles and some redhead named April, and then I thought April was slightly hot, so I started reading them. And then, uh, from there, I got into Casey Jones as this vigilante dude, and uh, there was a little blood in there, and I thought, shit, these are like ninja ninjas. These aren't kitty kitty ninjas. These are like. They get ninjas as turtles, and they're pretty badass, and then, uh, they kind of had a little angst to them, they're a little angry. So, that got me into them, and then as it went on, um, of course, kids stations got a hold of them and made them dumb. Uh, now this is the Halloween I remember as a kid right there, these sort of mom and pop costume shops. And, uh, I'm not gonna lie, guys, I really miss... Halloween as a kid. The one thing as an adult that sucks is not being able to be a kid at Halloween. Look at there's a wanted dead poster of me. That's cute. Um, it is. It is the one time 
Again, I'm not trying to get heavy with you all, but if you got kids and you're a parent, let them enjoy that shit as much as you possibly can, man. Because it gets... You know. You already... I don't even need to tell you. You already know how quick it goes. And, uh, it can suck, man. So... Don't rush it for them. Let them enjoy all that, right? Don't, don't push that shit. Just let them enjoy it. What do you do? Passive money drops. Special parrot friend. That could be fun. Um, and repair armor. I'd like to know what that does. I thought you sold out. Uh, no lotto. Coming soon. I scope. Are these coming soon or is this game done? I don't know. I need to look that up. And I'm not sure. I can't tell you if this game is done or not, but I will tell you it's deceptively addictive. Um, I'm going to do about 10 more minutes of this, so maybe two more rounds of this. You can see even the weather here and this town are both randomized, which I like. Portobello's. We had pizza the other night, actually. Um, God. Walking, shave, and a haircut. Both for $7.50. I didn't know that shit, babies. If you get, like, a... hot leather shave now, it's $14. I know, because yours truly uses a... professional... barber shop, uh... Razor to shave my face. Not because I'm some sort of hipster, but because, frankly, because I don't want to look like a hipster. I'm kind of like the opposite of hipster. I don't, uh, I don't want to have all that shit. Um, it says I'm here at level one. Do I keep my levels if I die, or does that go? I don't know. It'd be cool if I kept my levels when I die, too. I honestly do not know. I know, uh, I should have read more, is what I know. <laughs> but I do know that I like that all this is... Uh, see, I'm seeing a bunch of shit I did not see. I feel like you could play this game a lot. I, um, I also feel like I suck at it. But that I'm slowly kind of getting better. I feel like I need to use dash more to dodge. Do a little duck and weave and... You know... A little dash here and there, a little Sonic. A little slow de modi. Little hoopty loopty. Little hoopty doopty. Humpty dumpty. All that shit. The Humpty dance. Get that shit running. Fucking need to get that going. I didn't even know I destroyed any of this, but apparently I have. So that's cool. Um. But no, man. Halloween. <clears throat> Autumn, in all seriousness, that's what sold me on this game immediately, was the Halloween theme. You could, you could basically just put a pair of giant floppy boobies in a game, and write Halloween foods, and I would probably be dumb enough to buy it, just because the word Halloween was in it. Um, God, that 80s writing is perfect. We had a local record store that had wrestling, like, horrible, horrible neon like that. Um, I can just hit R and do quicker start, which I did not know, so we're gonna do that. Uh, no, my level does not stay apparently. Well, that sucks. Um, I do wish that I could, did not have to buy an outfit each time. I wish that, like, if I had bought an outfit, I could pick between outfits all over, you know what I mean? Like, I could just go back, like, here, and just pick an outfit I've been out of them. I feel like it would be slightly fair. Um, I mean, it is a roguelike, so it's gonna be hard anyway, but I feel like that's kind of a shitty thing. Um, maybe that comes with the stocking upgrade. Um... Let's see, stock upgrade status, da 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 da. Unlocks. Costumes, I got these going. This going. Unlocked items. Um, 
yeah, I really, I really wish that I could get that shit going on. Now, I wonder if the health and stamina upstate. Because if they do, that would be useful. So maybe we'll try one of them. This will be my last run of this, guys, so wish me luck. I like this music is even a little random. Oh, somebody just took a bite out of crime, and by crime I mean me. Okay, so those little freaks are fast. The bad freaks, those are the hit and run freaks right there. So we're gonna start hitting and running up. They seem to run out of ammo, at least. Nope, they do not. I mistook him for the other one. But you gotta hit those little suckers like dead on. Um, these dudes are like just like kids who eat too much candy and then you like go to bed. You're babysitting them and they're like, Mama said I could stay awake and they're like, no, she didn't. Your mom's a drunk. Don't, don't ever say that. Okay. Don't crush kids' dreams, that's not nice. But don't think their mouth cinnamon doesn't work as a strip for it's okay. Not speaking from life experience or anything, I'm just saying. They want to believe cinnamon is a, a, a nice name for their mom, you let them believe that cinnamon is not a stripper's name. That's all I'm saying. Which it's totally a stripper's name, let's be honest here. Not that I'm judging, you know? Single mom's gotta make a living, I'm just saying. Um, I'm totally gonna get some shit over that one. I've actually had, uh... Good luck so far. Like, the only thing we've actually gotten so far on our YouTube channel... Um, and I thought it was funny, because we are such a tiny little channel. Was, uh, Laser Unicorns actually noticed. On one of our neon, uh, arcade channels. That we had used one of their videos, and I, I'm kind of flattered because I'm a huge Kung Fury fan. Um, and they were cool with us using that video, but put a claim so that we could never monetize that video. Which, fair enough. I don't have a problem with that. Uh, so thank you to them for allowing us the use of, uh, the, like, the actual 100% use of Kung Fury for that video. I think that was cool of them. And also, it was cool just to be noticed by friggin' the company that made Kung Fury. Um, are you kidding me? Like, that's, that's one of my favorite, uh, movies. Had that, had that been, um, I didn't know that there was a Kickstarter. I probably would have donated money. Seriously. Uh, I must have watched Sun Fury about a, a thousand friggin' times. No joke, I, I love that movie. So, now why does the cat mask come out during 80 seconds? I actually don't know. I feel like this is just a bit more 80s. The colors, the, the brightness of it, the kind of neon, the rainbows remind me of like Dio. Um, like Granny James Dio, so... Plus, the rainbows were all over the 80s, let's be honest. There's a lot of like... It's radical and like, you know... I don't know. I don't have a great reason, frankly. It just... it is what it is. Just learn to love it, people. Learn to love it. Oh, my shit, that was a big firework. Okay, I don't like the firework ammo. Not a fan of that. I feel like this is like, set it and forget it like run fucking full peel. I mean, I'm not good with cooking the creeps. Cooking the creeps. Today I'm... Today I'm Bones and Gary. Cooking the creeps. You're cooking show for killing monsters. Today we're going to set the creeps for a nice 350, and then we're going to try and... Oh god, this is not good. This is not good. What is going on here? Okay, dude, come on now. That should have killed every fly in the area. Like, who am I kidding? Um, if you've ever had flies in your house, you know how hard those little shits are to kill. Um, somebody told me that for their, like, outdoor get-togethers, they take those plastic bags and they just buy clear ones and fill them with water and something about that when flies do a barbecue kind of these never fucking end 
Is that the deal with these things? That made you do not I need to get the hell out of this map because apparently, oh, so is is he spawning them? I feel like this little shithead here is spawning them, so we're gonna kill him. He is he's spawning them. Now we've got you. Oh shit, y'all! We got a boombox. Now we've done it. Now we've got the good shit. Man. How are we still just a level one? I feel like by now we should have gone up a level. We just laid waste to like a shitload. A shitload of flies. Enough flies to rename the Lord of the Flies the Lord of the Bones. And we still didn't get any. That's your shit there. This little shit here I hate. I do not like that guy. Damn right, it's critical. What is on? Oh my god, guys. Do you see what I've done here? Is that a head? Just a head. Let's show by real legends. I think that's funny that in all this chaos, it's just like all these cool buildings, and they put in enough afterthought to put in just one for sale building. I don't know why that stuck out to me just then. No. Well, let's see how we did. I'm gonna actually check the mark and see if I keep my level 2 or if I make it level 1 with that. I would like to say that if we hit a level, they let us keep the start of level. Fuck. I do not. Well, that's shitty. They do let us keep our store unlocks. And ammo unlocks and costume unlocks. At least that's cool. So, alright, uh. So, anyways, I am. Moi. Well, my name is, uh, Bones. Gary will have some other stuff coming up, and we will have a few Let's Play a Board games coming up this week, later on in the week. Um, this will probably be our last video game Let's Play. We have. Maybe one other one. I'm thinking about doing another M. Uh, I'm thinking about doing an M. Dicky one for you guys. Uh, let me know what you think. There's this game you did that is literally like Oz if it was on PCP and totally chaotic. Um, M. Dicky was a very ambitious programmer, but crazy um, with his programming skills and just put everything at once in one game. And, uh, it, 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 got, it got nuts. It got nuts. Not in a bad way, in a charmingly chaotic way. You'll see what I mean if I do the game. Anyways, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like. There's a little button over there where you can subscribe, or you can just click subscribe. Either one, baby, it don't matter. Uh, share us with your friends, share us with your enemies, share us with everybody. Uh, put us on your favorite social media. I am Bones. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.